Hi, I'm David McMeekin, Senior Lecturer in the School of Electrical Engineering, Computing and Mathematical Sciences within the Faculty of Science and Engineering here at Curtin University. If you look around, you'll be amazed to see what is actually software controlled. From your coffee machine, the car that you drive, the traffic lights that you go through, the escalators and elevators that you ride in, the banking system, all of these are software controlled. Somebody wrote that software and ensured that it works correctly. As you think about your future, what I want you to think about is think about problems that annoy you, issues that you think need a solution. And now think, how can you participate in solving that issue? Computing is about creating solutions. It's about solving problems. It's about creating a more effective, efficient and sustainable way to do things. It's about ensuring that the software that drives systems that control much of the world we live in are safe, secure and perform the function they need to when they need to do it. Really, a computer just does what we humans do, but in a much more effective and efficient manner. Our computing programs are about preparing you to work in the wide and varied areas of software and networks. We have two bachelor degrees within computing, and each degree has a different emphasis with different options. The first degree, the Bachelor of Information Technology. Now this course covers a huge aspect of modern computing and computer networks. It looks at network programming and distributed computing, which is really the foundation of modern cloud computing. A really fancy buzzword everyone's talking about, supposedly everyone's doing it, but tragically most people don't know or understand actually how to even utilise its power and potential. Students graduate with a solid understanding of the Linux operating system, the operating system that powers the vast majority of the internet. They'll have a sound knowledge of programming, computer systems and the processes involved in software development and maintenance. Our other degree program is a Bachelor of Computing. Now this degree program actually has software engineering and cybersecurity. Foundational to all of these majors are learning the C and Java programming languages as the tools for learning the core concepts within computing, such as object orientation and algorithms. Linux skills are taught throughout the entire course. We place an emphasis on learning the basics before moving on to the more advanced topics. Graduates from all majors will have a high level of knowledge of computer systems and processes involved in software development and maintenance. Our staff are involved in cutting edge research projects. For example, our cybersecurity research is looking at intrusion detection and developing new ways to detect when there are intruders within the network. It's developed so far that we're about to launch a brand new startup with world changing technology that's never been seen before in the area of detecting intrusions. Our researchers are involved in artificial intelligence and structuring data to better facilitate machine learning and artificial intelligence algorithms so that they process the data, drawing out new knowledge that's stored within that. Our researchers are working with art historians, archeologists and digital humanities people, developing technical solutions to assist them in understanding the ancient world so that we may perhaps understand our world just that little bit better. It is from these people involved in these projects, as well as other projects, from whom you will be learning. These researchers are on the cutting edge of computing technology, and they bring that research into the teaching and therefore the learning that you will receive here. A computing degree from Curtin provides you with an opportunity to work in many different places, doing amazing work, solving problems that once solved may change the course of people's lives and livelihoods. Like the app that we built, 
for people on the autism spectrum.